So just tell me, what does it feel like to inflict Burnley's first home defeat of the season? Just like it should, you know. It's an unbelievable feeling. Those boys have given me everything. Absolutely everything. I couldn't ask for any more today. We, the the build-up, the tactics we put in place, everything. You know, we're not going to come here and match Burnley for football because they're superb at it. They're in the top of the league. They've only, they haven't even lost here. So to come away with the three points for me is just awesome. That's for the fans and that's for the players and the people who've supported me upstairs and, and in the bo- and, 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 and the staff at the training ground, you know. That's for them, you know, because I'm sure people were getting worried. We're all getting worried, but... What's a football, what a performance by the boys, honestly. I could not fault any of them, and not even the subs and the boys who didn't make the squad, you know. I told them, 20 of you got on that bus and 20 of you going home with those points. That's superb, boys. You talk about tactics, you talk about a game plan. Tell us a little bit more about what you were trying to achieve, because Burnley had a lot of possession. Yeah, I mean, possession. If you look back at my Wickham interviews, I say possession can do one. Um, it does not. It does not win you games. You know, it's factual. This does not win you games. You know, it's, I think it's 51% says it does, 49% says it, it doesn't. It, it's so close on possession. It's moments. It's moments and people. And those moments today, I mean, they were, they were awesome. The, talking about the goals, OK, we can talk all day about the goals, which are two... Sensational goals, you know, really, really well worked. Sam Phil, what a finish. And then Chris Martin, you know, after the short corner routine. But what I will say is the blocks, the tackles, the saves, people putting their absolute head on the line, everything, you know, just on the line to stop shots, to stop. And there was one in the first half there where I think there was a shot at it, Rob Dickey, there was a shot at it, Senna Dieng, and it came back and it hit the crossbar and went out. And moments like that, you've got to think, this could be our day. And boy, was it our day. The boys were absolutely sensational. You know, it's a hostile place to come, especially for a Blackburn lad as well, you know. But um, the uh, the boys, the, the manager of the game, they they nailed the tactics to a T, honestly. And it's taken an absolute worldy goal from Burnley to break us down, you know. And I think you've got to give credit to the strike. But you've also got to say, that if that's what it took, that's what it took. We worked hard. The subs came on and made a difference. The ones who didn't get on were shouting about the boys. And those fans down in that end, they never stopped all day. So thank you very much. Thank you so much. It's been a real frustrating season. And we ain't out of the woods yet. But that's a hell of a point, uh, three points to, to put us up that table. And uh, everything's in our hands now next week and the week after. And, and I'll be telling the boys that you've given yourself that platform. Go and finish the job. When things go badly, everybody gets their share of the criticism. How satisfying is it for a manager to see it all come right as it did today. Listen, when things go badly, give me the criticism. I'm the manager of the football club. The players do what I ask. It's on me. That today is on them. They gave me everything. They were absolutely superb. To a man, everyone, you know, Albert's cramping up, Lyndon's cramping up, Aaron Drew's done his calf in the first half just trying to stretch for a ball, you know. They've, they've given me everything. And you know what? That's all I ask. And as a manager, what a great place that is to be, you know. So um, the boys deserve that today. The boys and the fans, and everyone's got behind me and supported me and believed in me. You all deserve that today because that's one hell of a step towards safety. Got to finish the job yet. I'm not going to get carried away, but that's a great result today.